Hey guys, it's day 45. I feel really good. It's still smoky outside from Canada. Thanks Canada. But I'm not gonna work out today. It's like seven o'clock in the morning. I gotta leave in an hour, so I gotta make something to eat for breakfast. Make my coffee, and then I'm just gonna go to work. It's Friday, so it's the last day of the week for me. And I'm just gonna come home and pick up one working out tomorrow. All right, for breakfast I'm having toaster strudels, two of them, 340 calories for the two. And you get icing, so. I'm cutting sugar out of my coffee this morning. All right, I don't know if you guys can see how bad the air quality is getting around here, but for some reason over the last hour, it's gotten 10 times worse. All right, I'm getting ready for work. I'm putting my boots on right now. I gotta go. I gotta get my hat. All right, so I'm getting ready to go to work. I'll capture whatever I can through the day. I'll see you guys there. All right, I got my coffee. I just talked to my boss. He says I gotta go hook up the electrical work. I gotta go do the lights and the fans. And then after that, we'll be going home. Gotta pack the tools up. He's going back tomorrow to do the sand and the spackling, but I don't have to go. I got one piece up, now I gotta cut another. All right, I'm at lunch. I am eating a Caesar salad with chicken. 500 calories if I eat the dressing, which I am. So 500 calories. All right, the salad was delicious. I'm about to head back to the job, hook up the rest of the lighting and the fans, and then I'm about to clean up and go home for the day. That's when my weekend starts. I'm done. Hey, I'm home. My weekend begins now. I just got a shower and I got a water. I'm brewing coffee right now. I'm chilling with Sadie. Hey, Pop. What you doing? I'm ordering chicken and broccoli from one of my favorite Chinese places. I couldn't cook. There's no way I was going to go food shopping after working like that and then come home, put it all away and start cooking. There's no way. All right, so there's my Chinese food. It's coming in at like 850 calories probably. I'm gonna just call it like 900, but this is chicken and broccoli. So there's nothing too unhealthy besides the sauce that's on the chicken. Good morning guys, it's day 46. We're almost to day 50. We have a lot of things going on this weekend. Like my sister's having a barbecue because she's moving out of state and I gotta bring a covered dish, but I'm on a diet, so I really don't know what to bring. I also need to find some nice clothes to wear. So I'm gonna, I might go clothes shopping. I'm gonna go in, exercise. I gotta get dressed, make my coffee, make my breakfast, and then I'm gonna be heading out. You know, I didn't want to do this this morning when I woke up. I just made myself do it, and I know in like 20 minutes, I'm gonna be so happy I did. This morning for breakfast, I had a Mike's Killer Everything Bagel with 45 grams of low-fat cream cheese, 350 calories, and that's all I had so far. 
I had my sugar coffee, so that's 100 calories. So I'm up to 450, so I don't really have to worry about what I eat out there. I just have to make sure that the portions are small enough. So it could be a slice of pizza. It could be a half a cheesesteak, but that would be like 500 calories. So you just got to be mindful. All right, I'm ready to go. I'm out. I'm sitting here waiting for my trolley. It comes at 6.01, so I'm just burning some time walking around. It's like 5.45, so I got like 15 minutes to kill. I'm just gonna walk around. Taking this, this is my trolley. All right, I'm at 61st in Baltimore Ave. The trolley stops here, so I had to hop on another one to go back. Fourth Street, West Philly. All right, I'm at this place called the Desi Chat House. It's on 42nd and Baltimore Avenue. There's a number right there. But I'm getting a chicken wrap. I'm about to see what it's like. It looked pretty good on the picture. There the paper and everything. All right, there it is. It's my chicken sandwich. We're gonna call this 600 calories. It looks delicious. Mm. Here's the ultimate test. Let's see how it tastes. Mmm. That's delicious. Messy. That's good. I watched the lady cook it, so it's like home cooked. 42nd in Baltimore and West Philly. You gotta check it out. But this is the place. There's the number. That was really good. If you're in the mood for like a spicy chicken wrap, that place is the place to go to. But I'm about to go get something to drink because my mouth's on fire. It's not too bad. It's not like I ate some hot wings, but it's kind of like I could have could have ordered the watermelon juice because they specialize in like special fruit juices, carrot juice and stuff. So I was gonna get the watermelon juice, I just didn't decide to, but that was a bad decision. So I'm heading to Wawa now. That was a nice little trip to West Philly. I got my coffee. I got to see some stuff. Now I'm going to go find a bathroom real quick over at the University of Penn. And hopefully it's open. And then I'm going to head back to Center City on a bus. So on my fitness app, it says I walked 3.6 miles so far, which is really good. I feel it, but we're going to keep going. stop right now waiting to go back to center city I'm taking bus 21 it should be here any minute there's my bus right there it's coming and the broad and chestnut that's city hall thanks man have a good one time finding a bathroom so if you need a bathroom and you're in Philly late at night you can go to Target up until like nine o'clock at night on Chestnut Street. That's the only place I could find them. I like the lights. It's pretty cool. It's like a movie theater. Alright I'm going to this place to get ice cream. I go in the guy's like do you have a card to pay with because we, we're not allowed to accept cash and I'm like no unfortunately I don't not right now. He goes it's on the house next time just remember to bring your card in. This was $15 for this and another ice cream because I'm with somebody. This is vegan, so. Oh my god, it's so good. That's why this thing's like seven bucks. This is just a little cup. This is made with oat milk. I don't know who's yelling. <laughs> I'm gonna go eat this. It's the best now. Got a cool spot that we can go. Give like a word, an idea, whatever you feel. And then um, I'll write you a poem. We'll work on tips. Just... Summer night in the soup. Yeah, I can do that. And then, uh, yeah, work on tips, just like $10 to $20. Oh, shit. 
Nah, I was gonna give you two bucks. Bro. Nah, I know that your skills are way worth way more than that. Never mind, I was gonna get the poem, but it cost ten dollars, he says. So I didn't have a good enough topic. I told him summer in the city. And I was like, I'll come back when I got a better topic. Yeah, yeah. It's starting to get a little late out here. Everything's kind of closing. People are still out, but there's not really much to do. So I'm going to head back to Jersey now. If you ever wondered how they get the streets in Philly clean, this is how they do it. They got the leaf blower and they blow all the trash in the street and they clean it up that way. So people just say that Philly's not clean. That's bullshit. They're going to come by with the street sweeper and clean it all up. Now. That's how they do it. My man with the blower still gotta get all this stuff on the side, just like cups and stuff. Doing a good job of keeping the city clean though, and that's pretty cool to see that. Pay for the train, it's time to go home. Should be like five minutes. I'm really thirsty. Nothing is open in Philly. Excuse me. Pop eight. Thank you, sir. Have a good one. Enjoy now. Thank you. All right, guys. It's one in the morning, so that marks the end of day 46. I'm going to go to bed. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.